Hello guys. Today, listen to me carefully. Very important, commonly used verb that's going to decrease the number of sentences that you explain yourself to the least level. If you use this verb, maybe you will get rid of five sentences to explain a situation. Very carefully listen to me. You are not going to be able to maybe catch this word. Maybe you see this word, but you will just skip. You will just think that it's not that important. That's why you're not going to even check the dictionary. As we do, you will just guess the meaning and you will continue reading a paragraph, reading in, while if you come across reading a newspaper or a book, anything. But pay attention to me right now. It's your right time to learn this word with me. Resume with someone. Can you see it? Is a verb, resonate, resonate with someone. What does it mean? Let's see it with a couple of example sentences. Where's Shay with the cream? Okay, so let's Shay with the cream. Am I here? Yeah, I think so. So guys, resonate with. What does it mean? Resonate with to reflect someone's feeling. You see an event, you hear something. It can be a poem, poem, it can be a film, it can be a scene, it can be someone that gave a speech. You found yourself in this specific activity. You feel these are your true emotions that you feel like. You know, you find yourself. That's called resonating. This is sharing my feelings. This is showing how I feel inside me. I wouldn't have just, you know, express my feelings. Is this poem if, if it wasn't for this poem, if it wasn't that person, if it wasn't for this person or something that speech, whatever. So let's see the examples. Resonate with. First example, the movie's message about family values resonate with the audience. So how audience found in this movie's message what they were expecting, what they were feeling. They felt something that the, the same thing in the movie. The same as it's parallel with what was audience are thinking. So the second example, the poem resonates with me on a profound level. So whatever the poem is saying, whatever poem poems content is, resonate with me. It's parallel with my feelings. The same feeling, same deep feeling that I got that poems is saying. The third one, a song with lyrics that express feelings of longing and nostalgia may. I don't know how to pronounce nostalgia, may resonate with someone who experienced the homesickness. Yeah. So if someone experienced homesickness, they haven't seen their family for a long time. If these lyrics, this song is about these feelings, it is normal to resonate with someone who is experiencing homesickness. So a heartfelt story might resonate with someone who has faced similar challenges. Yeah, it resonate with someone who is expressing the feeling someone Oh my God, what's happening? Guys, it should not happen, but it happened. Wow. Yes. And last but not least, sentence. A motivational speech that emphasizes the importance of pursuing one's dreams despite obstacles can resonate with individuals who are seeking inspiration or facing their own challenges. Think about that. There are some individuals who are seeking for inspiration or facing their own challenges. That's a motivational speech. When they hear give all ears to this motivational speech. Oh my God, that's what I'm thinking. That's what I was looking for. So this motivational speech resonate with individuals. This motivational speech reflect the ideas of these individuals who are, who are, who are seeking inspiration or facing their own challenges. Resonate, have the parallel feelings, have expressed the feelings of others. I found myself, it's what I'm thinking. These things resonate with me. So, for example, one of your friends is telling something to you. Whatever you said resonates with my feeling, resonates with me. Okay, I hope this helped. This is a very important word. This is you very commonly. I've encountered it many, maybe seven, seven times, but nowadays I haven't encountered it. Maybe I'm not reading a lot of excerpts, reading materials. That's why I totally and completely and definitely, you know, suggest you to learn and drill over this word, try to use in your sentences. You will, I'm a hundred percent sure you will encounter it. See you in the next video, guys.